Your doctor may recommend surgery for your Crohn's disease when your body does not respond to other treatments, or when inflammation leads to abscesses and scarring, which causes blockages and severe pain. The type of surgery needed depends on how severe the symptoms are and the exact part of the digestive system affected. Many surgeries for Crohn's disease can be done using laparoscopy, a minimally invasive option where multiple smaller cuts are made. To treat a small blockage or narrowing in the intestine, a strictureplasty uses a cut to widen and reshape a section of the intestine without needing to remove any part of the organ. For a larger blockage, a bowel resection may be used to remove part of the large or small intestine and combine the healthy ends together. Iliocecal resection, or an ileocectomy, is used to remove the end of the small intestine and the beginning of the large intestine. The healthy ends are then reattached. A colectomy is the removal of most of or the entire large intestine. In a proctolectomy, the rectum and anus are removed in addition to the large intestine. For both a colectomy and proctolectomy, the end of the small intestine is then usually diverted through a hole in the abdomen. A bag is attached over the opening to collect waste that would have previously passed through the large intestine. Talk with your doctor to discuss the risks and benefits of surgery to see which may be best for your condition.